Are you looking to work on your chest and triceps and you want to find a way to work with a functional trainer or you want to use bands and you've clicked on the right video here we're grabbing that decline fly and we're going to go down consistent tempo here i like to usually go slower and as you can see i'm bringing it across that nipple level i recommend you bring it a little bit lower make sure you straighten out your arms and then on the way back you want to bend those elbows when you relax and you want to do that over and over for this exercise of the decline fly do it four sets of 12 reps this is also a decline fly and it's one of my favorite for getting a good chest pump working that chest nicely for strength if you're looking to get your bench press up give this exercise a try it is an alternative to the decline fly and it is another way you can train it. it's training it at a much lower level different is a good thing we want to mix it up we don't want to always do the same weight or the same reps or the same sets we want to mix it up one time do heavy one time do light one time do a moderate weight one time go for endurance mix it up i call this the classic one you want to bring it a little bit lower than i'm doing it at but this is what my preference is and what i like to do with this one is just go to lighter weight but i like to go for more reps so i recommend doing this one on maybe 20 reps for four sets maybe five depending on what your goal is but it, this gives me a good burn Incline chest fly from the lowest level is great for building that chest and working that incline chest, of course. So what we want to do is we want to come up like Spider-Man, get those pinkies together, elbows in, one foot ahead of the other. And I like to do this one for maybe 15 reps of four sets. Give it a try. Remember to still rest for 45, 60 seconds. No access to a functional trainer. Don't worry about it. We're going to use bands. Bands are easy to use and they're cheaper than what's behind me. So you're free to use that instead. And with bands, guys, we want to remember to still take our time. I'm working with 20 pounds here. And after a good workout, you really do feel it. Here I'm setting this up. So I want to use 30 pounds now. And we're going back to that decline fly. I just want to show you guys how you can be creative with bands and how not to limit yourself. I didn't have any equipment when I first started. So I came up with a bunch of different ways that I could train. And also Google is your best friend. So if you're not sure about something, feel free to Google it. But with the bands here, you can see that I'm still working my chest nicely as I was before. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I really appreciate your support. Thank you for watching. Drop a follow, comment. I want to hear from you guys. You have a great day.